right guys, so today's gonna be a dedicating throwing day. And I'm still working on a lot of the same things. Still working on high releases, deep throws, and quick releases. And my legs are a little bit sore today, so I'm gonna take a break from the agility drills. And at the end of this, I'm gonna play a game of disc. So here we go. So I feel like this gym floor is just a lot better than the one I was at last week. Last week my foot was just slipping so bad on every throw and I haven't noticed any slipping yet so that's great. So the first time I did this drill I was kind of waiting until the disc hit the target before I threw the second one. But what really needs to happen is I need to throw the first one and while the first one's still in the air I need to step out and then make the second throw. So this time I'm working on throwing immediately after I make the first one because that's how you get a fast time on this drill. So that was definitely the fastest time I've had yet. I threw immediately after I got the first one out of my hand and the throws were accurate. So I'm really happy with that run. So next I'm gonna be working on some mid-range high releases and working on my pivot balance going from backhand to forehand and making good accurate throws.
Okay, so I'm gonna finish with some control mids and then we're gonna play a game of disc. So just a refresher on the rules for Game of Disc. So there are 10 rounds of challenges. If you fail a challenge, you get a letter. If you spell D-I-S-C, you lose. If you get through all the challenges before spelling D-I-S-C, you win. So the first challenge is going to be to throw 10 discs into the target area. You have to get them in a row. If you miss any of them, you fail the challenge and get a letter. So here we go. So the next challenge is to get 10 in a row inside the target zone. So because I did all backhands on that, the next challenge is going to be same thing but forehand. So for this challenge, you either make it or you don't. So the first throw is going to be through that first gap with a backhand. The second throw is through a forehand through the gap. If you make it, you beat the level. If you don't, you get a letter. Game.